In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to configure screens and screen schemes in Atlassian Jira. This process is essential for customizing your Jira interface to fit your team's workflow better, making it easier to manage projects and streamline your tasks. Let's get started. First, we need to enter the Issues section within the Jira administration settings. Navigate to Screens, where we'll be setting up our new screen. This section allows us to fully customize the fields and layout to suit the needs of your project. Once you're in Screens, click on Add Screen to begin the creation process. You'll need to assign a clear and descriptive name to your screen, along with a brief description. This not only helps you identify the purpose of the screen, but also assists other users in understanding its function. After naming and describing your screen, click Add to save it. Now that your screen is created, find it in the list and hover your mouse over it. On the right hand side, you'll see three dots. Click on these and select configure from the drop down menu. It's here where you can start customizing by associating specific fields with your screen. You'll see a list of available fields. Select those that are most relevant to your needs. After selecting your fields, the next step is to configure the layout. This part is all about organization and ensuring that the information is accessible and logical for your team's workflow. Arrange the fields in the desired order and format. Spend some time here as a well-organized screen can significantly boost productivity and reduce confusion later on. Moving forward, let's talk about screen schemes. Head over to the screen schemes section. Schemes allow us to associate multiple screens with specific issue operations like create, edit, or view. This means you can have different screens for different parts of your operations, providing flexibility in how information is presented and interacted with. To create a new screen scheme, click on Add Screen Scheme. Similar to when we created the screen, you'll need to provide a descriptive name and a brief description for the screen scheme. This will help communicate its purpose and ensure it's used correctly across your project. Once you've filled out the name and description, you'll need to select a default screen from the dropdown. This default screen is what users will see unless specified otherwise during specific operations. After making your selection, click Add to finalize your screen scheme. By following these steps, creating, configuring, and carefully naming your screens and screen schemes, you'll enhance your Jira project management environment, making it more tailored and efficient for your team. I hope you found this guide helpful. Feel free to revisit any of these steps as you continue to refine your Jira setup. Thank you for watching, and until next time, happy Jira managing.